Hey everyone, this is Ricky with M3D and we're going to move through a quick start guide with you to get you up and running with your Micro 3D printer. Let's get printing. We're assuming that you have already downloaded the software and you're getting it ready to print, but you haven't completely taken off the gantry clips yet. The gantry clips or the front gantry protectors are these purple pieces right here on this orange printer. So you see there, I just put my thumb underneath this area. You're going to lift them upwards. There you go. Okay, so once you remove your gantry clips, then you can download the software at printm3d.com forward slash support, and then connect your printer. So I've plugged in my power cord into the wall outlet, and I've plugged in my USB cable into the computer. Now I'm ready to connect the cable into the printer and I'm going to plug it into the left port on the rear face of the micro. Now I'm plugging in the power. The LED should come on and the device should be recognized by your computer. So here we're going to load the filament through the external port. Once you're ready to load your filament for printing, you will need to select the 3D ink button at the top left. It will give you two options on how to load filament. For now, we are going to use the external port option. The second page will ask you for your filament cheat code or filament type. Enter the cheat code displayed on your filament spool. Once you have entered the cheat code, click Next. And the printer will heat up and extrude the factory filament first. Once your filament is extruded, you will click Yes to end the filament loading process. Great! Now you have completed the load filament process and you are ready to print. Drag and drop existing models in your library to the printer or use the file browser by selecting the open model icon at the top left. The M3D software is compatible with standard 3D model formats like .stl and .obj. It will let you control the basics like rotating, resizing, and positioning of the model prior to printing. Click and hold the right mouse button to quickly resize, rotate, and reposition the model while keeping the same aspect ratio. You can also center the model and reset the view. Click print and the print setup page will open. It will give you information about your printer, as well as provide print quality and fill density options. Select more options to add or remove support material and the raft. The slicer will process the model and provide an estimated print time and filament amount used. Make sure to clear the bed before continuing to print. So that's it. This is how you start printing with the micro. If you have any questions, please go to our support page at printm3d.com forward slash support.